Hey folks, welcome to Fix Your Jiu Jitsu, and today we're going to talk about a way to troubleshoot your butterfly hook sweep. Um, all a sweep is, is just removing your opponent's bases and moving from the bottom position to the top position. So if you can remove as many bases as possible, you should be able to hit the sweep. So your opponent can base with their hand, their head, their elbow, their knee, and their toes, and they can use their hips to make themselves heavy. So if you're able to block off as much of that onto one side, you should be able to hit the sweep. So let's take a look at Marcelo Garcia, who's on the right, performing like this sliding butterfly hook sweep. So right now, um, Rafael has his hand committed to Marcelo's collar, and Marcelo has the elbow blocked. So all he has to do is worry about the lower body now, which is getting that knee out of play. So from here, the elbow drops, so let's get that elbow out of play. Let's just do a slight little tug on it, and that's going to drop him onto his shoulder, which is usually the ideal position to finish any sweep, when the side of the head is on the mat and the shoulder is connected to the mat, because from there, it's just an elevation problem of getting your hips higher than theirs to finish the sweep. So we're going to watch this again in slow motion. So the upper body is committed and blocked. Now let's worry about the lower body. Let's get that knee out of play. Knee's out of play. He kind of bases on the elbow, but it's okay because he pulls it out of the way. Gets his hip higher than his and drives him down to the mat, staying connected to him throughout the sweep to ensure that he lands on top. So it doesn't matter how big your opponent is. Um, Marcelo can sweep. Gabby Garcia, it doesn't matter. You just have to remove the bases. So here... Gabby is going to commit her hands to his back, and Marcelo just gets an overhook on her arm, and it just makes it so easy to sweep. So like I said, the hands are committed, elbows blocked, and his foot is blocking her hip. Then you just elevate to get your hips higher than hers. You get the sweep every time. But sometimes you get stubborn opponents who are really bouncy and jumpy and just as energetic to not get swept. And what they'll do is they'll they'll try to jump out and widen their base. But it's okay, you just have to stick with it, especially if you have their their um their arm and they're balancing on their head and their toes. If they're balancing on their head and their toes, it's just a matter of elevation. So one more time. So here he was trying to break that grip but just kind of fell. But it's okay. He lands in the butterfly and goes for the butterfly hook sweep. He has his arm, like, isolated. So he can't base on the elbow at all. So he's just trying to balance on his toes. Just get your hips higher. You will get the sweep. Now, this was a great match. What I, lo I love how Bouchesha just used Hodger's momentum to sweep him. Hodger is going to try to do a... Um, a butterfly pass by pushing down on the knee and moving off to one side. And Bouchesha does a great job of committing Hodger's hand to his knee. So he's forcing Hodger to stay committed to the knee and he sweeps him over just with no problem. Because he's balancing on his head and his toes, like I said, he just needs to get the elevation to sweep him over. So one more time. Here, he forces the hand to stay committed. He's balancing on the head and the toe. So now it's just about getting your hips higher than his hips. That's all a sweep is, getting higher. But every now and then, you'll get a guy who's like Shanji Hibero, who's super balanced and won't get swept that easily. But that's what's so fun about Jiu Jitsu, you know, it's a back and forth. You have an answer for them, they have an answer for you, you need to have an answer back for them. And that's where the troubleshooting comes in. You know, if you didn't hit the sweep, you need to figure out how you can get it next time. But that was a beautiful counter done by Zhangji. Alright guys, I hope this video was educational and enjoyable. Like and subscribe if you want more.